Oh, Falcon. Come back, Mixie. I miss you. But here we go. We have Paulu versus Rob. Jen and Dill. We've seen this many, many, many times at many a local. Um, yeah, we're going over TNC. A, a very good stage for both characters anyway. Yeah, and Jen, you know, mm -hmm. seemingly already having the, the gyro combos kind of just labbed oh, out. Yeah. Getting that 54 up on Dill right now. And Dill kind of just trying to clap back with the down tilts. Doing that damage, but ah. Jen with the reflect. <laughs> shutting down any attempt Dill has at coming back. Look at the top. The Beyblade is just keeping Dill just locked up in the corner right now. But Rob Nair is finally going to break apart the pieces. And Dill can finally play the game. Maybe, it, could it be for long though? Finally getting, oh look at that little attack, we get the dash, let go of dash, grab A with the, get the gyro, easy peasy. Uh, that's just one of the things you have to really learn about finding Rob is picking up that gyro. Dash and let go of yeah. dash while you press A, and you pick up gyro almost instantly. So, that's that John Numbers tech, you know? Yeah, that, that, I, 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 that video is hilarious. Because it's been, it's, so been, it's been sent everywhere. So either way, Jen using that uh, that platform kind of as a way to, yes, to yeah, use it, it as be an stalled, extension. Can't be Absolutely. hovering. This is the one stage, at least the one stage setup, because it does cycle through. Um, that Dill absolutely just can't really hang on ledge for that long in the air, because you can catch her so easily. Yep, and now Dill is just stalling at the ledge over here. There's not really much you can do against Rob. Kind of just forced to sit and plan your uh, attack. Much like Jen is doing right now, but Dill just coming on swinging with the rotor arms, looking to do some work and doing work with the forward air, putting an end to that first stock right now. Absolutely, and now we have a tri plat situation going on here where the middle platform should be really, really good for Rob, really for those uh, those throw kills if he's able to get Jen to that percentage to do so. The other platforms are really good for Jen in that regard where it can really extend off of the back air that Paulo's really good at, um, at hitting. Yeah, and Jen is still looking for Oof. these conversions to just off the air into the fair. Not quite getting it, but in a really good position to start trapping Dill right now. Dill just coming out swinging with the neutral air. Not quite getting anything. Jen just leaving room for Dill to come on up. And come on up, Dill is doing right now. And Dill planning her attack right now. Just coming on in there. The reflect sniping out the gyro and not quite finding nice. things with the rotor arms. But S Smash will be cleaning up that stock. Yeah, Jen recognizing to not sl to slow down a little bit of his recovery option against Dill. Actually, does rotor arm and then doing forward smash against it as a punish. Super smart, super adept play from Jen right there. And now Dill has to really ca keep up this percentage, uh, or at least try to get this percentage back up for herself before Jen gets some extra credit for himself right now. We really need to get this this stock kill as soon as possible. Yeah, and Jen was just looking to uh, intercept the laser with the back air. Mm -hmm. Without invincible shield, you definitely could but did not have the, the timing on it, very, not quite. And Jen is still doing a really good do job at just trapping Dill in the corner right here. But now with that dash attack, Dill gonna be getting out of the corner with a really well-timed dash attack. And now Dill is in a really good position just over here to kind of just trap Jen and just keep using um, the space to her advantage. Yep. And also with Jen, we have almost max rage going on right now against Paulu. Dill is really struggling to really kill right now. We have Rob, of course, also with uh, with rage. But it almost has to be enough if, if Jen is able to control this side of the stage efficiently against Rob. Oh, nice. Jar uh, the throwing Jarrah up to kind of back Jen off a little bit and taking that second that second stock from Jen finally. And Jen dropped down you can, immediately. You can just let it rip like that. Yeah. Just, just saw where Dill was going to go and was like, I'm going to just force my I got the iframes. I yep. could just go on out there and smack your right on with the wings. Absolutely. Have you, your you Red could. Bull. You could. You're funny. <laughs> I had to like take a second. I was He's like, like wait, wings? why is there Red Bull? He's like, oh, oh you're funny. <laughs> you're funny. Totally didn't seal it. Totally didn't seal it. Uh, bands included Battlefield and Smashville. We're going over to Kalos if they respect this. Because there's been times where they'd be like, oh, I'm going to go with this. And then they go with like, a different stage. I'm just like, y'all playing with me. But look, see? They're playing with me. Wait, what? They, they definitely they did. Me. No Kalos, just no small Kalos, Battlefield. No Kalos, just small Battlefield. And Jed is just already bursting <laughs> right out the gate, just trapping on the platform with the up air conversions just all around. Playing real smart, getting that parry game on lock. Just keeping Jen, or keeping Dill in the corner right now, playing real safe, catching the jumps with the Nair. And she is just still unable to find this, uh, a, 
there. I cannot speak. Please this help. Lead. You're good. I got you. I got you, man. I, please help. I cannot speak. Just, just trying to figure out a way to get this lead back up. Dill is really struggling to get back on the stage. Finally, doing also with a simple roll in and actually reversing the situation that they were in earlier. Now, Dill is really showcasing her power on the center of the stage and, of course, on the ledge where she knows that she can out dominate Jen. Come on now. It's Rob. Play with me. Down yeah. smash. And I love the up tilt to kind of just get Jen just throwing out an air dodge, much like that, and just the down smash to just linger on out and close out a stock. And now Dill is just sitting really, sitting in a really comfortable position right now. You know, have a lead against Balu. You can kind of wall out and just find your attack just right. But now if Jen is just coming up on you with that top, just throwing out these back airs, much like that one. Absolutely. I was going to say, you know, although. Jen, um, I'm sorry, Dill is a little more comfortable in that situation. You still have to be very weary of what Palo can do against you as a smaller, as, as a uh, slower, bigger character. Oh, I was about to say smaller, and I was like, oh, that's not, Rob's not smaller than Palo. <laughs> He's a big boy, you know? He's a big boy. And now, one of, okay. Ooh. Yeah, one of the things that Rob kind of struggles against with uh, characters like Palo is that disadvantage, and, you know, Jen is just. A Kind of just evading all these rotor arms, not really falling victim to the rob, but he will be falling victim to that up smash. Yeah, and Jen, it's just almost like a complete reversal of come game one. We had Jen really dominating on the the ledge mostly against someone like uh, Dill was Rob, where Dill was very comfortable on the ledge, very comfortable actually off the ledge in the air and using as a advantage. But now that Jen is kind of dominating on ledge once more, Dill is struggling again. What Dill has to really do is, yeah, these roll-ins are what's going to be saving her. Jen doesn't really account for those that often, as often as he does with like neutral get-up or get-up get attack or even jumping. So really good on Dill for recognizing just rolling in is probably the best option against uh, Jen right now. By the way, just uh, want a reminder, this is the start of top eight, so this is best of five. Oh! Yeah. We got another oh, game to okay, go. Okay, okay, got it, got it. Yeah, and Jen's um, conversions this sequence have just been so, so tight just to just get up to that 124 on Dill. Definitely able to just close out this game if he's able to take this stock out from Dill right here. But Dill just going on high, trying to evade the up air. And the top just locking Jen in place. Not able to forward the Palu agenda right now. And Bob. Dill just channeling the inner zombie bear, closing out that game too. I think the biggest thing with that gyro is that you couldn't see it. Because I didn't know it was there either. It's, I it like didn't see blends it. with the stage. It's a little white, you know. Like I can barely. You see couldn't it. see it. Look, look, look. There's yeah. It, it was. It already happened a few times, but you, I didn't see it. I, straight it up, blends with the rocks. It blends in with the black with with the with the stage straight up. So again, we are going in a best of five territory because now we are in top ocho. So this is a fun time. This is where we get to like it's a party. Five hours of Smash left. I'm so excited. Let's go. Let's go. My carpool's gonna hate me, even though we came on train. You be all right. <laughs> I don't know if Dill's all right right now. You know, sitting 55 and the ledge against Jen, one of the best ledge trappers piling the Palu, especially with this parry game too, you know? Just wait just to see what panic option they're gonna throw out, covering Dill in the disadvantage. See the parry game, but just running on through with the dash attack, kind of just overextending in that case. Yeah, I I'm just trying to see if Dill was able to oh, and she can, she absolutely can. Finally converting the situation to her own, just kind of switching the positions as much as uh, fast as she could and taking that advantage as far as she can as well. So with Rob now on the ledge and Jen really advocating for staying on the ledge as well, it's a ledge trap. Uh, Dill has to kind of work her Wait, look, again, rolling in as an option. Straight up. Jen's always down here looking, fishing for the down twos and fishing for the up airs, but never accounting for roll-ins, unfortunately. Yep, and Jen is just covering all the space that Dill goes. There we go. You saw the the back air coverage, you know. Bill drew it out of spot dots to try and cover herself. She's trying to eat Apollo back air, but look where you look what happened. You ended up eating Apollo back air because you were tensing up in that situation. And now you're just eating all this damage against Polly right now, just on the back air train, all aboard. But Dill with a really good laser is just gonna be getting herself out of that situation right now. And it's still just swinging onto John right now. Getting up that damage and uh, trying to push into this first stock that he has. I know, seriously. It's just, just a, oh, that was beautiful converting the gyro down air into just an, a, a gyro Z drop into down air. Wow, hi. That's a mouthful, wow. Yeah, Z drop, down, Z drop gyro into down air. Like, hello? 
Uh, let's see. Now we're kind of playing a little bit of neutral. Oh, I lied. We're going straight with the, with the back air, taking that first, uh, that finally that first lock off of Jen. Thankfully, this game is not the one that did taste the next one. So uh, at least not the, 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 does not to take the whole set. So we are still chilling. Dill has still a whole other lease of life left on her, but she has to really uh, start wrecking some damage, or else this will be a hard game to come back to. Yeah. There we go, just like that. Dude, Jen yeah. is starting to capitalize on these spot dodges that uh, Dill kind of throws out in a panic to cover herself when he sees when she sees the parry just happening and just going on. And Jen with the long range snipe with the Beyblade, I love that. Just tucking the damage right there. And Dill just still sitting at the ledge here. And gotta watch out when Paula just jumps from the ledge because that's kind of like her get out of jail free card. If you let her jump, get that teleport cancel on in, she's just moving all around the platforms and you're losing your position. And uh, I agree. Once you have Palu doing all that, it's, it's, just, it's just difficult to deal with as someone like Rob. Slower, again, slower, bigger, has more to like uh, deal with against Palu. Whereas Palu. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, we're good. I thought we took her off the stage. I was like, no, oh, Bestie, what are we doing? Yeah, he was chilling. He's chilling. And, and he caught the top too. Oh, you're you're dead. We are not chilling. You're you're definitely not chilling with we're, the rotor. We're worried. Oh no, the high recovery really good for for not actually staying with that option for too long. Could have easily been uh, turned into an up air kill from Jen. Yeah, I love the di on the up tilt to just kind of get that nair in, and Jen is putting in work with all these back airs, kind of just ruling this ledge right now. Catching the air dodge to ledge with the good old Nair, suspending Dill to burn more gas as she just tries to come back from disadvantage right now. But against Halu, you're in a very scary situation. Definitely had the kill there with the air dodge, but he's still, oh my god, untackable. Untackable, that red flash, you cannot attack that, you are dead. I won like 164, 174, that'll definitely do it. And I see that one more time. Just effortless dash back into gra to getting the grab in exactly where Dill was going to land to. And here, I think we have a, yeah, yeah. the back air right against the side of the stage. Smacked Rob's face right into that rock and then bop, dead. And I saw he tried going for the down tilt at the corner over there, trying to catch that, uh, the air dodge in. But, you know, we have other plans with the Apollo back air. There we go, really nice starter for Dill. Finally, we're keeping this a little bit more of an even game, at least for the start of it. Yeah, and that was a beautiful tomahawk from Dill, just getting in that grab, doing in some damage right now. But you have to watch out with these nares when you're playing with Rob. I understand it's a very good option. It's like minus three or four, minus three and four on shield. But you have to watch out where you place them because if the other player just has their parry game unlocked, you're gonna be eating a lot of uh, punishes for that. Mm -hmm. Getting all that damage on your big Robo body. And Jen is just clapping back with all these Beyblades, letting the top just rip, putting on that damage and forcing Dill into the corner right now. I know, Shape, you're absolutely right. Jen's ability to use Jero to his own advantage, even though he doesn't have Jero as often as Rob always does, and not being used to it is so good for him. But unfortunately, unfortunately, <laughs> Dill is going to be taking that second, that first, like I'm sorry, with um with arm rotor on the side. Yeah, that arm rotor, the hitbox is just so deceptive. It swings it all around. It's okay, we're good. Much like you know, Paulo was just swinging all around with that back air, taking stocks, not meaning anything. But unfortunately, Dill just back airing into uh, Jen's way, hitting with him with the spot dodge, not really getting much of anything, letting just all these lazy nares kind of just rip on the shield. And Jen is just able to capitalize so much on them, just getting in that damage. I just want to notice just Jen's little poke at the gyro to like disengage it is so funny and also really just smart of him to do. Rather than just letting it be active for so long, just poke it and it goes away. Yep, and he can just get that damage yep. going on much more e or he can pick it up much more easier if he just gets a little stop that momentum, a little mm -hmm. tap. And we're going with back throw against the side of the platform or side of the stage. Oh, there we go. I'm missing the up air, just kind of teleporting away from the situation. And hopefully this is not going to kill, of course, on Jen's so low to the threat to even be possible. But that certainly will, even though it wasn't even the, that wasn't even the good spot of it, but that killed, let's go! Yeah, but we got that back here. We're doing the damage, and Jen 
is looking to make quick work of this stock before Dill gets ahead of herself with this 140, you know, two stock lead right now. And uh -huh. there we go, the explosive flick just popping, taking out all the stops right now. Uh, we're at a set point right now in favor of Jen. If, if Dill doesn't hit the stock right, the ice is game. We're gonna have to go to uh, towards just Jen taking it all. So hopefully Dill can get some some rage going, some uh, really good rumble Rob combo stars going as well. Down to down to down to into, you know, up to into up air. Super good for Rob. You can see these cracks are starting to show a bit because Rob doesn't have the best disadvantage at these air dodges. No, he Jen is just trapping all of them with the up airs, building up that damage on Jen. But you know, if Dill just reigns it in for that one second, gets that one gyro rotor arm confirmed going, it could easily lead into a game five. That's what I'm hoping for. I'm hoping to see a game five here, but with Dill's slowly racking percentage and the way that Jen is just carrying her across the entire stage from one blast zone to another, it's getting, oh, us, it it's getting it. scary out here. The damage ra is racking up right now. We got the reflect, just getting the damage up on in. We have the the top just bringing up the damage. <gasps> oh, we just canceled out the up, the up smash. Oh, no. Yeah, and they're quite, not quite killing because uh, it got nerfed like a few, few patches ago if you uh, haven't for... Uh, there, I cannot word. Double gyro into dash attack? You're hilarious. Man was definitely gaming. What was he cooking? He's cooking these Rob. Bro, does he know? Does he know? Does he know? Does he know? What was he cooking? The double gyro, the double gyro throw into dash attack. Hilarious. Well, I, I love that feedback dash to just... He's like, hey, the space is open. You can just nair here. And Jen's like, no. no. Dash attack. Dash. I fooled With the you. Shield. 